Mr. Speaker, the Minister of Trade was in Manila on November 19th. She had her seat reserved on the government challenger to make her way back home, but instead oh. she booked herself through L.A. and charged the taxpayers nearly $20,000 for a trip to Hollywood. Wow. And the reason? A vanity interview. While the interview with Bill Maher was painful to watch, it turns out it was just as painful for Canadian awful. taxpayers. Oh, so man. why have Canadian taxpayers been stuck with the bill for her California dream? I'm the Secretary for International Trade. Mr. Speaker, we're, we're proud of the work that our minister has done advancing, advancing Canadian interests around the world. All expenses on all of her trips, Mr. Speaker, are transparent and done according to all the various ethical uh, guidelines that are imposed on her. Member for Red Deer Lacombe. Bucks. Well, Mr. Speaker, cabinet ministers can do what they want with their personal vanity projects, but Canadians shouldn't have to pay for them. First-class tickets from Manila, two days in Los Angeles, with her staff in tow. Why are Canadian taxpayers footing the bill for a first-class trip to Hollywood just so the minister can be on an American talk show? Good of opponent, your secretary. Mr. Speaker, it bears repeating that all... Mr. Speaker, it bears repeating that all of the minister's travel is done according to guidelines that are set and she follows all the rules, Mr. Speaker. We will continue to be transparent in this regard.